Interest is building in the 2018 gubernatorial election. Incumbent Larry Hogan wants to be the only second two-term Republican governor in Maryland history. Now a new poll shows he may have a fight on his hands. WJZ is live. Political reporter Pat Warren has more on what that poll reveals. Pat? That's right, Jess. Now, Larry Hogan is still enjoying high in the 60s approval ratings, much like the Goucher poll last week. But this Mason-Dixon poll shows he may have some stiff competition. Together, we will change Maryland for the better. According to a new Mason Dixon poll, Marylanders know him, have a favorable view of him, and 61% approve of the job he's doing. But the poll also raises a question about Larry Hogan's chances of reelection. It shows him that uh, although he's very popular, he can't rest on that popularity. Incumbent Republican Larry Hogan leads all his Democrat rivals, but still polls with less than 50% of the vote. A match against Prince George's County Executive Rashern Baker gives Hogan 46%, Baker 39% of the vote, with 15% undecided. Hogan gains ground against Baltimore County Executive Kevin Kamenetz, 48% to 35%, with 17% undecided. He wins a match against former NAACP President Ben Jealous, 49 to 33 percent, with 18 percent undecided. And Hogan's number doesn't change, 49 percent to 30 percent, for State Senator Richard Maddalino, with the highest number of undecideds at 21 percent. Larry Hogan is polling in the 60s in approval rating mm -hmm. and just general likability, but he gets less than 50 percent of the vote in the general election. What does that mean? Well, it probably means that people's uh, party ties are more powerful, more important to them than their evaluation of the governor. Uh, and Maryland is a two to one Democratic to Republican state. A statement from the Hogan campaign states in part, as this poll clearly shows half of rank and file Democrats approve of Governor Hogan's performance in office, putting their out of touch leadership in Annapolis in the distinct minority even within their own party. But the Democrats say Hogan's path to reelection is growing increasingly narrow. And the Mason-Dixon poll on the Democratic primary puts Rashern Baker, the Prince George's County Executive, 17 points ahead of Baltimore County Executive Kevin Kamenetz. I'm Pat Warren reporting live now back to you. Pat, thank you. The poll was conducted between September 27th and the 30th and has a four-point margin of error.